Hello! Did you know that Gary's Mod has merchandise? Official and unofficial? Yeah, there are shirts, stickers, hoodies, jackets, and my personal favorite, the tool gun replica. But there's one bit of Gary's Mod merchandise that nobody seems to know, let alone talk about. I'm talking about the official Gary's Mod flash drive. Yeah, no joke. This is a real product licensed by Face Punch Studios and made by Just Toys, the same people that made the previously mentioned official toolgun replica. So let's have a look. Upon first glance, it's pretty simple and straightforward. Not much to say about it. What you see is what you get. It's got simplistic packaging, but at least it fits in with Gary's Mod color theme, using blue and white and little bits of gray in there. It also advertises on the packaging that it comes with preloaded content. The heck does that mean? This rubbery casing shows off the iconic blue and white G logo. Because you can't have Gary's Mod without the G, but the flash drive itself isn't really that impressive. It has 8 gigabytes of storage on it and looks like any other flash drive. But I'm kind of disappointed they didn't get creative with it. I mean, come on, they could have put some logos or references on it or make it look like a prop from the game. Heck, they could have, like, made it blue or printed the G right on it and it'd be more fitting for Gary's Mod. What a letdown. It also works on Windows 95 up to Windows XP. Good to know. Now, what's this preloaded content that it mentions on the packaging? Well, let's plug it in and take a look. On the flash drive, there are several folders labeled Face Poser, Gravity Gun, and Head Crab Party. Each folder contains a collection of pictures referencing their respective folder name. Face Poser is just G-Man with a wonky face, Gravity Gun is a reference to the easily recognizable minge bags, and Head Crab Party shows a happy little head crab having a party all by itself. It's cute. You might have noticed that each of these pictures, except for Head Crab Party, are the same images used for a few Gary's Mod trading cards on Steam. Honestly, I think these are just intended to be used as wallpapers, hence the different resolutions you can choose from. You can also use them on your Facebook banner, iPad, or PS Vita. Now that's trendy. And there you have it. That's everything there is to know about the Gary's Mod flash drive. I'm glad I managed to find and get one of these when I could, mainly so I could prevent it from falling into obscurity. So what do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And with that said, thanks so much for watching. Bye friends! <laughs>